the evening was, is I have had a history of skin cancers from getting sunburns when I was a youngster. Hey. And so somebody told me, what you need to do is go see this great dermatologist and she'll use liquid nitrogen and burn these spots off your face. Okay. And so she did. And now what I've got is little white scabby things that come up on my face where I was burned. Okay. And then they fall off and it's still relatively raw underneath. And eventually the little scabby thing comes back up and it falls off again and it's still raw underneath. Is there any oil I can so use? How long ago did, did they burn those areas? Like, you know, with the nitrogen? About a year ago. Oh, wow. That's a while. I, I, so one of the things that I would say there is I would try using spikenard. Okay. Spikenard is a great normalizer and balancer in the skin. Mm-hmm. And it's very soothing in times where you're not sure what to use. Sometimes spikenard can be helpful. Okay. My second choice would be helichrysum, but mm-hmm. I, I think it's probably more a spikenard issue. Okay. Yeah. Um, spikenard in like... Um, like something real light, like a... a, a neat sesame, probably, sesame oil? Yeah. Neat would probably be okay, but I'd almost put like a few drops of spikenard and then maybe twice as many drops of the sesame and then rub it together with your fingers and then rub it into the spots. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Very good. Yeah. Okay. And yeah. Yeah. And um, the, the, the comments about trouble re- not reacting to the world. Yeah, I have that too. It's yeah. like, I, I mean, <laughs> it's hard not to get worked up about that stuff. Yeah, you, you know, it's well, it's hard not know, to throw up about it. You know, yeah, I mean, like it's, it's just, it, you know, it it doesn't. You know, somebody said something about, well, I don't read politics. It's not just politics. It's the no. world. The world's like it seems to be every know. freaking thing at once. Yeah, there's the fires and there's the the heat waves and there's the you the know it's just and, one thing after yeah. another after another after another and yeah and um you know I was talking with a buddy not too long ago and he's just like you know very intelligent guy and he's just like I I don't know what to think and I was like I think we just need to breathe and ride this thing out like you know, yeah you just adjust and adapt and we're so used to things kind of being clearly laid out and if something happened it was like we could all look at it and go wow that's crazy but it's like every day is crazy now like mm-hmm. every day is just crazy yeah some less yeah. crazier than others but yeah. there's super crazy days and moderate crazy days but every day is crazy yeah and um yep. okay yeah. all uh, right excellent Thank you. It's 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 a thing. Like I, you know, it's a changing of an age, and you know, granted, that usually means a bit of chaos. But boy, it's yeah. Some people tell me I signed up to be here for this. Yeah, I want to see the contract. Show me my signature. Yeah, it's it's a lot. And, you know, it's going to calm down, but, you know, at some point I was like, I don't know if it's even going to be in my lifetime. Yeah. (laughs) No, like at first I was like, oh, as soon as the pandemic's over and now I'm like, hopefully, you know, by the time I'm leaving the body, it's calmed down. You know, I just don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Thanks.